and today we're taking a look at how to clean your enamel Dutch oven. And this is an easy and simple way to clean your enamel Dutch oven that you can do three or four times a year or whenever necessary. And remember, everything used today, we're going to leave a link on the description of the video. The first thing that we want to do is remove any grease or food particles to the inside of the Dutch oven. And we do that the old regular fashion way with soap and water. And we're going to use warm water because that's going to help dissolve any food particles stuck to the Dutch oven. If you find the food particles are too hard to remove, you can add a little bit of water and put it on the stove for a few minutes. And that's going to help you remove those hard stuck on particles. Then you want to take your double sided sponge and using the green side, gently scrub all around. You always want to use these types of sponge. You never want to use metal sponges because they can damage your Dutch oven. And you want to start with the green part and then move on to the spongy side. Now that we're done, now we're going to rinse it off with some water. Now you want to place it on a flat surface on your counter and we're going to go ahead and fill it with water. Remember you want to leave a little space at the top for when you place the top. Now what we're going to do is add one teaspoon of bleach per two quarters of water. In this case, this is an eight quart pot. So we're adding four teaspoons, meaning if yours is four, then you add two. If it's six, you only add three. And for any half numbers, you can round it off either to the more or to the less nearest whole number. And a pro tip, you want to tell your family and friends that live in the home not to drink or touch the water, or you don't want to get it in your clothes neither. Now we want to mix the water and the bleach until it's well mixed. And this, we're going to let it sit for 12 to 24 hours. In our case, we're leaving it for the whole 24 hours or overnight. Now it's the next day. We can go ahead and dump the water. As you can tell, we can already see a change on the pot. Now we want to remove any excess bleach. And we do that again the old fashioned way. Soap and water. And remember, this is something that you only want to do a couple of times a year. Or if you don't use it that much, once a year is fine. And as everything in life, once you clean it one good time, then you just have to keep on with maintenance. If you let it go too long with stains, they might not come out. That's why it's good at least once a year to go ahead and do it. Now, as you can see, it's back to new. Don't forget, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. That really helps. If you have any questions, place them in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow us on social media. Thank you for watching. And here's a link to our latest video.